Kanye West is awesome because he just brings in so much imagination from within us. You know what I mean? Like, never did we ever imagine someone to be so ignorant, but yet talented at the same time. Oh, did you did you see him on his like radio show circuit going from? Yeah. And then you see the thing with Sway. Oh, man. Now, you I... don't know, Sway. You don't have the answer, Seven. <laughs> you don't have the answer, Seven. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I met Sway a couple of times. And he's such a calm brother. That's yes. the first time <laughs> that I've ever seen yes! him, like, go oh in. Oh, my God. It was weird. Like, but that's Kanye. He will bring out, he will bring out your animal in you. Now, is Kanye that ignorant? Or is it all an act? Maybe he really is brilliant. Because... If he didn't act up and go on this little radio tour, no one would talk uh -huh. about his album, except for, like, you know, some of his radio buddies that, you know, oh, Kanye's great, he's amazing, he's amazing. If he's so amazing, why over the last several weeks all you've been playing is his old stuff? Mm, bang. I'm just saying. But he wasn't always like that to, to get hype about his album. Oh, Was man. he? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I never paid attention to him. So maybe this, <laughs> that's why I'm saying maybe he's brilliant. You know? No, 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 he's just angry. He just has first world problems. You know what first world problems are, right? Did you say Will Smith problems? First world problems. Oh, gotcha. But you know what? Look at I'm... what he was arguing about. Yeah, I why know. Why won't the fashion world let me in? Who gives a fuck? <laughs> but you know what? Excuse me. I think I think I think I understand Kanye. Go ahead. You ready? It's yes. good. It's good. It's good. All right. His last interview with uh, the Sway thing, and there was one after the last two ones he did. I noticed he kept saying a couple of things. Michael Jackson's the best entertainer. No one could ever have that title. Um, Me. Biggie's the best rap. You know, like he just named different people that had these titles. So. I just think he's he's at that point where he's starting to realize that mm -hmm. he's a pop artist. Like, pop artists, as big as they are and as much money as they make, 10 years mm -hmm. from now, you don't care. So I'm thinking, he's look, you know what? The niche that I have is fashion. So I could be the fashion hip hop guy. I can make product. I can make, this will be my niche to make me go down in history. Now, I don't think that's gonna happen but it is a niche that you know it's like it's like if i okay if i'm a i gotta disagree there but go ahead okay i'm a ukulele player and i Ooh. play underwater and i rap Ooh. i could be the king of ukulele playing underwater and rap so that's what kanye's trying to do just like they tried to make uh beyonce the they gave her some title for a second she's a queen of something <laughs> you know everybody wants a title you know what I mean? Like, I'm Mary J. Blige, the, the queen of hip-hop, R&B, soul, or... You, you know, they just make up stuff as they go along. Um, I mean, Michael made his, his title, King of Pop, so... Yeah, but but, it, but he, he, but he, he could, he, because it's true. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So, I, th I, I understand Kanye. He, he's, he's having a midlife crisis at 36 that, years old. Thank you. That's all it is. Right. But his, have you ever seen his clothing line? No. The first, it's gotten progressively better, but it's not the best. It's not, you know, it's not Alexander McQueen where it's just going to stand out. You'll be like, oh, my God, that's innovative. That's, that's something that I want to wear. That's not right. calling to the masses. That's not feeding any creativity. It's just kind of basic shit. Well, I've so, I heard from people that I am friends with within the fashion industry, mm -hmm. they um, their critique was pretty much like his first season sucked. Yes, and it did. And then he fired everybody, hired people that, you know, it was kind of like, well, I'll just keep, I have money, so I could just keep hiring people with actual talent, and at some point, I'm, I'm going to make it happen. And you know what? At some point, he will make it happen because he has money. Right. But what was he crying about on the radio show, though? They um, won't let me in. They, they won't, won't let you in. Go in the back door. Climb through the window. But you just continue creating. 
and stop well, crying. This is the about thing it. because I I understand this part too. Oh. He he could he could do it independently, and mm -hmm. he could probably sell a good amount and make a decent living for the rest of his life. But he'll never mm -hmm. go down as the king of anything. He'll never go down as a legend. He needs their he needs their cosign because that's what he wants to be that he wants to be the top he just doesn't want to be another rapper with the clothing line. with the clothing line right okay. and i get it but you know I what understand. i have a secret you're just another rapper with a clothing line but don't tell him that you know and he did go yeah. to art school kudos to him i mean he you know he he even said in an interview yo i'm not a rapper and you know what i knew that no from he's the an beginning. artist he, he was never a rapper. He he was a producer. He was a beat maker that happened to be able to put a couple words together. Because even his rap style is just yelling and talking loud. It's not. It's put put play um, Big Daddy Kane. Play Jada Kiss. Play Ludacris, and then play Kanye. Then strip out all the music and just play an inch, like a acapella with lyrics. Okay. Okay, he's nowhere near the top 10 of rappers ever. He's just a pop artist. He's just got some hits. No but offense. He... <laughs> I love you, Kanye. Love... Let's I work together. I love when they say no offense. You know what I mean? But it's offensive. No. So, so I get it. I, I hope he does what he needs to do because that would, that would immortalize him. Right now, he's going down in history as the angry black guy with a whole bunch of money and one of the hottest chicks in the game that blew up by making a sex tape. No, no, please don't call her hot. And what game is she in? Um, the you reality just, you just, star you just use, you just use a Jay-Z line to describe those two <laughs> relationships. And I can't co-sign for that at all. <laughs> now you're just, show. now you're Bring just, you're hate just back. <laughs> comparing Beyonce to Kim Kardashian. Speaking of Kim Kardashian and Beyonce. Oh my God.